Welcome back audience. I'm so serious, fans react to BTS's Jin's funny response to Sukjin's comment about his new look on the latest episode of Ren Jin. Now, please take a minute to hit the subscribe button and flip on notification bell for greater updates and watch this video until the end. On Tuesday, September 24th, the seventh episode of BTS Jin's Ren Jin aired on Bangtan TV's official YouTube channel. This week's special guest was Ji Suk Jin, comedian, singer, TV host, and actor. BTS Jin and Suk Jin started the episode by greeting each other. They recalled their previous meeting during the Running Man episode released in 2022. Afterwards, Suk Jin asked BTS's Jin how he could still look so young, and the singer replied with a laugh, saying that his face was the their livelihood. Of course it's my voice, but this, his face, is my livelihood, Jean said. When Suk Jean asked for details about his new look, BTS's Jean offered a comical answer. Although Suk Jean is 50 years old, Jean joked that Suk Jean is young even at 70. He looks very young for someone who is 70 years old, the singer said. BTS Jin's fans and other viewers of the latest episode of Ren Jin made funny comments about singer Epiphany's mood. I'm not serious, one fan wrote on Twitter. Many people had similar reactions to the last interaction. One of his fans said that his sense of humor was the most attractive thing about him. Only Jin can give a compliment and a roast at the same time. Wrote one fan. Jin's divine sense of humor is one of the most attractive things about him, said user X. I think it's so cute that Jin admits that all his jokes about his looks are just to make people laugh, but he does it so naturally and he really has a beautiful face, like oh god you'd never guess said one. Fans, meanwhile, a fan said that Jin would be loved even if he had neon green eyelashes. She doesn't know we love her so much, even though she paints her eyebrows neon green, said one viewer. It's so frivolous, someone needs to stop it, said one fan. He's so good at pranks, said another fan. The first game of episode 7 of Ren Jean was collecting envelopes to earn a key for future challenges. Despite three attempts, both stars continued to draw failed envelopes. The real game started with a food-themed challenge where the two had to guess the name of the dish based on its zoomed-in image. The next activity presented a challenge, including watermelon papingsu and cheesecake as a reward. To make their choice, the participants must carefully remove the paper sheets from the heat-sealed containers placed vertically. The last game of this episode was a trampoline exercise challenge set to the songs Butter and Fire by BTS. Both participants were given pedometers to quantify their movements. Although Jean won the game, Suk Jean got lucky when he picked the bust. The first had to do more exercise, while the second received the water as indicated on the selected envelope. The seventh episode of Ren Jean ended with a preview of the next episode. As shown in the teaser, Jean and Suk Jean of BTS will continue to face new challenges in the upcoming episode. New episodes of BTS variety show Jean Ren Jean are released every Tuesday on Bangtan TV's official YouTube channel. In episode 7 of the show, the fans were treated to several cases of the evil laugh of the member of BTS and they could not help but be amused. Many have labeled him as funny, annoying, and evil for his antics. After seeing this side of him many times with BTS members over the years, fans were thoroughly entertained by his cheeky behavior once again. Seekjin can really make the people cry with his excellent laugh, said one fan. No one is as funny as him, said one fan. That laugh is my favorite sound and the best serotonin ever, said one fan. Doing his iconic laugh while making fun of his enemy, he's the cutest, said another fan. Fans also recalled the times they heard his laugh in the past. Oh my god, that evil sarcastic laugh of Jin's that we unlocked thanks to Ren Jean. I live for him, 